Hey guys, Alvin here. So you're looking to improve your video quality and audio for your Zoom. You came to the right video. And in this tutorial, basically going to show you what equipment you need. So the very first thing you're going to do to improve your video quality on your Zoom call is to choose the correct webcam. So I'm going to show you a video comparison between the laptop which you are viewing right now comparing to a proper webcam which is C920 which I am using right now. So what you're looking right now at this video over here is actually the C920 video and comparing it to over here that is actually the laptop webcam. So you can see there's a major difference between the two because this is in full HD uh, recording here and that one is not even in full HD, it's at 720p. That's the big difference between having a webcam and not having a webcam. Alright, so I hope I'm convinced that having a webcam actually helps you to have a sharper video. I know the video you're watching now is a bit dark because I not adjust anything on the webcam which I'm going to show you in another tutorial how to adjust the lighting and the quality of the video which will look much more better later on. So uh, now what I'm going to do now is I'm going to compare uh, the audio from the C920 to compare it with the computer laptop and a professional uh, microphone so that you hear so now I'm going to play right now uh, let you hear uh, audio from the laptop hi guys I've been here testing the microphone audio right now using the laptop webcam and the laptop inbuilt microphone that I'm listening to right now let's read from John 3 16 it says for God so loved the world so much that he gave his only son so that everyone who believes in me may not die but have eternal life amen Okay, now what you're listening to and watching is from the C920 webcam and the audio that we're going to test now. So we're going to read the same verse. For God so loved the world that he gave his one and only son that whoever believes in him shall not perish but have eternal life. Amen. Alright, the final best setup for best video and audio. I'm using now the road. Uh, USB microphone which I later on give you a list of what the equipment I use you're listening to the microphone now and the video watching is a C920 as well I'm gonna read the same verse again for you to judge the difference for God so loved the world that he gave his one and only son that whoever believes in him shall not perish but have eternal life amen all right welcome back and I hope now you're convinced that having the right webcam and the right microphone makes a big difference uh, we'll talk about lighting in another tutorial which is after this uh, but what I want to share with you basically what are the equipment that I use going to show you right now on Amazon and uh, where, what I'm using the main camera that you're seeing right now is the C920 Logitech uh, which you can see it now on your screen all right so it's about close to about hundred dollars to hundred and fifty dollars depending where you are buying it from so that's the price range uh, most people are using this camera uh, for streaming and everything if you cannot get this one you can also look for this model which is c920x uh, price range is almost about the same the difference is slight difference only with the x uh, having it improve slightly on the uh, resolution and frame rates. Uh, if you have a big budget, the third webcam I will recommend would be the real, which is really overkill. Uh, this one is two hundred over dollar US, which is come to three hundred dollars. You don't really need this. This one has four K, uh, recording, but we don't really need that. But if let's say you are desperate to look for a webcam, this is one of the options. Uh, by the way, all the links and description of all the equipment can be found in the bonus and resources or in the description uh, below in the list. All right. So that's for webcam. How about audio? Uh, when I first started my YouTube channel, the first, uh, actually the first audio equipment that I used was actually the audio technical. Let me go and search that. Okay. But I don't really recommend it because, uh, it's so it's not too bad but i was using this one so i was using the odo technical at 2020 usb which is a very old microphone uh, i don't recommend it now uh the best value for money uh usb microphone you can get today uh in 2020 is the Rode microphone that you are seeing now on the screen the anti-usb mini mic 
uh, this costs about 99 US to about $120. It's very small and compact and it works on USB. You can even monitor your audio. So it's pretty good value at a pretty good price made by a pretty good company. <laughs> All right, so you can check that out for microphone. Uh, if let's say you cannot find this, you want to use the one that I am using. The one I'm using is this one. It's the Rode NT-USB. It's a slightly more higher end version of that one. That was a mini version. This is the professional studio mic. So the big difference, this one has actually an audio jet you can plug in, you can monitor audio, you can adjust as a knob. Uh, whereas the smaller mini, there's only one knob as you can see here. So this is the one I am using and I'm pretty happy with the with this purchase. Uh, the reason why I recommend this tool mic because this tool mic comes with inbuilt pop filter. You can see this little thing, this black thing here. All right, that's called a pop filter. So that when you blow at the mic, it will not record those pop sound. So both these mics have pop filters inbuilt in them, which helps you to have good audio quality. All right. So the if these two mics, you can't get them for some reason, you can consider the Blue Yeti, which is a very popular microphone. Uh, this one comes about 100 to 150 dollars around there depending on uh, the ready stock and stuff so the price will change all right due to the pandemic and the demand for all these things all right but take note this one does not come with a pop filter so you need to buy a separate pop filter if you are getting this one all right so those are the three uh, microphones I will recommend you to get uh, if you want to improve your video and audio for your zoom calls Hey, so I hope you enjoyed this video and understand the importance of having a good webcam and a good audio equipment is very important in having good Zoom video calls. Alright, if you enjoy this content, do remember to consider click and subscribe to our Get Us Tech channel for more such tips. Also, you want to also click on the links here. Alright, I have a video after this about teaching you how to improve your video having good lighting, which is pretty important as well. As you can see, if I add a light to this video, right, you will have better quality video. So you'll learn more about how to have the proper lighting for your videos. Click on the video here to learn more and I'll see you in the next video.